Hey guys, I'm Nick Meister, and welcome back to Let's Play Hitman 2 Silent Assassin. And, uh, last time I think we came back from Malaysia, and now we're going to... I don't really remember where we're going. Uh, let's just go there. 47, this is Diana. We require your services once again, and this time you will have to prove your money's worth. Our client has lost some cargo, which he wants back at any cost. It appears to be stolen by a bunch of renegades armed to the teeth. The cargo is hidden somewhere in the desert. This is a two-stage mission. First, you must eliminate Lieutenant Ahmed Zahir and get a map from him. It shows the location of the cargo. He's quite weak, has a pacemaker, and goes for a nap every day after noon prayers. So this is a good time to eliminate him without raising any suspicions. If the alarm is sounded, the mission will fail. He is well guarded and behind locked doors, where only his trusted personal bodyguards have keys and access. Both his and the guard's quarters are situated in front of the palace. When this is done, you will have to kill Colonel Mohammed Amin and steal the key he's holding. It's an important part of the cargo. Call me when you're done with the lieutenant, and I will brief you on the whereabouts of the colonel. On the video, you can see both targets. It's the lieutenant entering the house. I repeat, eliminate the lieutenant without any alarm. Get the map and call me for further information. I don't think I've ever heard the word lieutenant pronounced luftenant. Or maybe there's something wrong with my hearing. I must work at Carnawares. Carnawares, I should say. There we go. That's the first guy we gotta kill. Oh, I'm sleepy. Uh. Yeah, I hear you, buddy. I get sleepy in the midday, too. And... Colonel Amin, who I believe was that other guy. Huh. It's kind of strange that, uh... The colonel is out and about, whereas the lieutenant's sleeping on the job. You'd think the colonel would be like, You lazy bum, don't do that. Hmm. Guard quarters. You know, I don't think I've ever gone here before. Huh. Um, oh, wait. Or am I... Am I confused? Ah, whatever. Fuck it. Um... Yeah. Let's get started. <clears throat> uh, FYI, if I haven't put it in the title description, I'm gonna be playing through all the levels in the Middle East, I guess. Let's see here. Um, there we go. <clears throat> Excuse me. Only one way in here for me, it seems. If I make an inconspicuous approach, I should blend in just nicely and get the job done. Probably a few obstacles to clear away. Right, so... Here we are, dressed in the local attire. And, uh, we can run around freely as long as we don't uh, go anywhere we're not allowed to. Which, of course, we're going to do right away. Alright, take this lock here. There we go. Now, the man upstairs, the lieutenant, is going to be looking the wrong way, hopefully. Oh, shit. The reason I ran in the corner there was to make him look the other way, but... Okay, good. Alright, he's still looking the other way. Hopefully, he'll stay looking that way. So, uh... Yeah, he's very sleepy, but he hasn't quite decided to lay down yet. Can't really say I blame him. That bed doesn't look too comfortable. And... Diana, there. it's 47. First part of the mission is completed. What's next? That's perfect, 47. Now continue to your next assignment in this area. To comply with our client's wishes, you must assassinate Colonel Mohammed Amin and obtain the key he's holding. He is right now in the souk with a bodyguard. When completed, you must proceed to the eastern gate to exit. Remember to dodge any guards looking for infidels on the way, but hurry, when the guards find out that the lieutenant is dead, the colonel will most definitely try to escape. Right, so you gotta be really careful sneaking out, because these guys are... Uh, I don't know, 
know, I guess, what's the word I'm looking for? They're, they automatically come in no matter what, so there you go. Now, um, I think she called this place the Sook. I thought it was supposed to be a bazaar. I've never heard that word Sook before. <clears throat> but anyway, the colonel is in here shaking down uh, the local merchants for some reason. Where is he? There he is. Don't want to draw too much attention to ourselves. Hmm. Wow. They really went all out, uh, you know, trying to create the, uh, the atmosphere in this level. Yeah. Okay. Gonna run back here. And now, uh, we have to play the waiting game. It's what's all, it's what's Hitman, blah, it's what Hitman is all about, is waiting. So, uh, it's gonna take a good you know, three or four minutes, so I'm gonna cut that out, and I'll see you guys in a minute. Or rather, five minutes. Okay, finally, after some waiting, we're ready to move in for the kill, so to speak. He's going to enjoy his smoke, and we're just going to very carefully, slowly creep up on him. Oh, shit. Oh, huh, no one noticed. Nice. Okay. It's kind of hard to tell whether or not you're successfully being sneaky in this game. Don't don't mind me, I'm just... Yeah. You just go back to your patrol. Don't worry about your boss. And uh, we're just going to make a run for it. Down this way, and... There we go. Silent Assassin. Nice. Um, I hope you enjoyed that very smooth playthrough, because this next stage and the stage after that is going to be nothing like that. It's going to be a bloodbath. 47. Your target is a local Khan, Abdul Bismillah Malik. You won't have any trouble recognizing him. His picture is on posters all over the city. Smila. He's currently trying to sell the cargo to the UN, which is here to check out the goods later today. The Khan is returning to his palace together with a contingency of UN troops. They will arrive from the east along the road. Eliminate him before he reaches his palace, but without harming any of the UN soldiers. It will be detrimental to business, 47, so keep it clean. The villagers are a bit edgy if they catch a foreigner carrying big guns around within their perimeter. So watch your move. Alright, so the second uh, part of this uh, Middle Eastern uh, adventure is a sniping mission. Oh boy. So here's the stage. Uh, like she said, the limo's going to be coming out of the desert. But not for a few minutes, so that's going to give us plenty of time to get over to here to get our stuff. Um, after I figured out how to do a clean playthrough of the first stage, I was thinking about... There's the Abdul. Or there's Abdul, rather. And here's a picture of his limo. It's a limo. Right, so I was thinking I would do the same thing with the other two stages, but honestly, uh, I don't really see the point. Um, right, again, we can run around all we want. No one will bother us until we start killing people. Um, I kind of feel like these Middle Eastern stages are very empty. I realize they probably didn't have the resources to make a huge crowd like they did in Absolution, but it just feels very, uh, very empty. So, I don't know, I, I just don't really... Yeah, I feel like I'm in, I'm in an empty... An empty, like, wasteland or something, you know? Whoa! That guy was dodging bullets like the Matrix. That was weird. Marhaba, ya sadiqi. Mr. 47. I am very honored. I have your supplies. It is very powerful. Take care, nobody sees it. It's very dangerous. The Khan is returning soon. Maybe you can stop him. Maybe before they get in east. May Allah help and protect you, Mr. 47. Thank you. 
Better get out of the way. This will get messy. Yeah. Ugh. Hey, buddy. Can a log give me better aim? You think? I just missed that guy back there. He wasn't that far away. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Alright. This is an absolution, so we can't, uh... We can't stuff this thing in our jacket. So, uh... If I was trying to play in a more... I don't know stealthy way, I'd have to figure out how to sneak past a million guards and a million different, uh, civilians and stuff. That's not gonna happen. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna shoot my way to a high point. Actually, right there. Oh, hold on a second. Wow. Wow. Wow, that guy's still alive. Come on. Oh my god. Whatever. Actually, I got a better idea. There. I like that. Let's see a lot stop those. Hmm. Hmm. Huh? Oh, shit. Didn't mean to do that. Mm-hmm. Alright, this gun is a one-hit kill no matter where you hit. Huh? What? What happened to that guy? Hey. Cut it out, you bastard. Alright, so anyway. I told you it wasn't going to be clean. There we go. So anyway, um, up here is, I don't know, the best place, I think, to shoot. I guess you could shoot from there, too, if you really wanted to. If you had the patience to sneak up there. I guess I could have watched a video of someone else playing through it and getting Silent Assassin, but, uh, I don't know. I mean, why not just watch the other video, right? Hmm. No one else seems to really care that a bunch of... The soldiers are laying with their dicks in the dirt in the middle of town, so, yeah. Um, pretty sure Diana said this, but you're not allowed to kill in any of the UN members. So you gotta avoid all these soldiers here with blue hats. If you hit them, then the mission's over. Hold on a second. There we go. There we go. Pretty sure he's dead. 47. You yeah, he's dead. Alright. Now, they are shooting, but they're not really shooting at anyone in particular that is shooting, because that's what they do. Alright. Want to get out of here without getting my ass kicked too much. Alright. Now, there is a hole in the wall. Uh once we go through this mosque here. Fuck you. Alright, let's get out of here. There we go. Oh, I'm a slayer. Cool. It's really cool. Uh-oh, it's those damn Russians again. I, are these guys in the Middle East? Because that must be really uncomfortable. You know, wearing those... Well, I guess not that uncomfortable. It does get cold in the desert at nighttime, right? Is that a good way to hold a rifle? 47 is dying really here. About guns. Your assignment is to eliminate Lieutenant Youssef Hussein, Lieutenant, commanding okay. officer of an underground base. See the surveillance video for ID. Also, you need to secure the cargo that the Khan tried to hide here and have it transported safely to the surface. A chopper will pick up the cargo. 
Lots of soldiers on the base and patrolling guards on constant high alert. They will react immediately and swiftly if you are detected. Stealth and surprise is important here, 47. I repeat, access the base, take out the lieutenant, and secure a safe transport of the cargo to the surface. Take out the lieutenant. Okay, Diana, thank you very much. Let's check out the video. Okay very sleepy man there. Oh, there's a guy we killed. Isn't that guy from the first stage you played? Alright, and you're just gonna stand there and he's gonna drink. Okay. No, that's that's uh, the guy we gotta kill, Lieutenant Hussein, who looks exactly like the other guy we killed. And this is the box we gotta get. Okay. And here's a map of the area. Here's the underground compound. I'm sure there's all sorts of cool little things you can use to sneak in, but I'm not gonna sneak in. I'm gonna shoot my way in because, honestly, yeah, I didn't think I'd find a series of levels I disliked more than the Japanese levels, but I found them. Oh, fuck. Okay. I wasn't planning on getting spotted that quickly, but oh well. I don't think anyone else heard it, so... Nice thing about this rifle is that it's a one-hit kill no matter where you hit. So, uh... I don't really have to worry about getting a headshot. Let's see how many more of these bastards do we have. It's this guy, this guy. Alright. Oh, I took that guy out. <laughs> okay. Um, there. Oh, here we go. Pasta sauce all over the walls. Who else is left? I guess these two guys. They're awfully close together. What are they doing? Making out? No making out on the job, guys. Come on. Ugh. Yeah, I'd really hate to be a security guard. Or any kind of guard, really. Must be really boring work. This is the, uh... Another guy coming around soon. We're gonna kill him as well. There we go. Nice. Right, so this is a facility that has the elevator that takes up our box. Okay. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Now we're not gonna need this anymore. Hold on a second. Wait, how do I drop shit? Oh, there we go. Yeah, we're not going to do that anymore, so. Okay, let's take out this baby. That could have gone way smoother. Could have gone way smoother. Wow, I actually died. That's a little embarrassing. Okay. Okay. What the hell was that guy looking at, anyway? That was weird. Alright, so, do over. I'm gonna try not to embarrass myself this time. Right, so, I don't know if you guys noticed, but, uh... This guy actually gives us some useful information. 
Thanks. Fuck you. Alright. Um, what I was saying was this guy tells you where our, our target is. Although, considering I'm going to be playing this game in the most brutal fashion possible, it doesn't really matter, since I'm probably going to end up killing everyone anyway. I don't think so, you fucking bastard. <laughs> oh, shit. Ah, oh, fuck. Damn it. I don't think so. Nice. Right, so they're just trying to trip the alarm. All it really does is make more guards appear. Not really a big deal when you got an M60. Die, die, die! Ha ha ha. Alright. Not exactly sure what these things are. They say Hitman on them, and he has a lot of them, so, yeah. Maybe it's a special edition Hitman soda, hmm? Alright, I think I've had enough stealth. Um, let's switch to the M60. Now, this baby is a one-hit kill, no matter where you hit, as far as I can tell. It's kind of like having an automatic sniper rifle, I guess. Uh, but, you know, with without a scope. Nice. Oh god, more guards are coming. What the fuck am I gonna do? Gotta make a last stand, guys. Ha. That was easy. Really? That's it? Oh. More guards are coming. Good. Wow. These guys don't really seem to be very concerned that there's an alarm, huh? Right in the back of your fucking head. Yeah. Right there. Yeah, yeah. Die. Okay. I think I've had enough of that. And if we were trying to be stealthy, that alarm would probably, uh, be some cause for concern, but, well, since I just killed everyone in the facility, I guess it doesn't really matter, huh? Also, because I didn't kill everyone up above this time around, I don't think... I think I'll have to have a tiny gun battle up here, Nice too. work, 47. Secure the perimeter at ground level in case any soldiers have turned up. I love 47. It's like, what? This shitty stage isn't over yet? Bruh. Alright. Okay, yeah, they're all dead. Whatever. <laughs> and this gun's slowly pulling into view. That's funny. Postal. Wow. Huh. Quite an honor. So, I wonder who these guys are supposed to be. Just killer monks or something, huh? Kind of makes you wonder about the kind of decisions these people must have made in their lives. You know, they figured, yeah, I'm going to dedicate my life to this particular religion, but also I'm going to be a badass commando. Alright, so... Another job... Uh, well done, I think. Um... 
Yeah. Not much to say, really. Um. Didn't enjoy those stages at all. So I think, uh. I think the next stage is some other thing. I don't know what. See you guys next time. Why? <laughs> Why? 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 Why did it have to be like this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh.